We're at it again. It's Friday morning. I'm driving to a spot to hunt. It's raining a little bit. It's gonna get wet. That's all right. Well guys, I think it is October 6th and I am officially heading out for my first afternoon sit here in Pennsylvania. I'm actually not hunting on my property today. I'm not seeing a lot of activity on the trail cameras and stuff like that, so I'm kind of just letting it sit. But this other property that I do hunt has a lot of good deer. There's a lot of nice daylight activity going on. Last night a buck that I am after actually was uh, right under the stand that I want to be hunting during daylight hours so hopefully he does the same thing tonight the wind is the same as it was last night um, so it should be a good set it's awful hot it's already two o'clock so I'm headed out pretty early but I have uh, the afternoon free my son had a hockey game or a hockey parade this morning and tomorrow we're going on a train ride with the family so the wife let me get out this afternoon and uh, I'm just happy to be in a stand so hopefully uh, we can get a deer on the ground early. Alright guys, well, I'm headed in. I'm awful early. It's hot. So we'll see what happens but I'm really excited for my first afternoon sit. This property has a pile of deer on it. Got the RER with me. Hoping for the best. Well guys, it's October 10th and I'm back out here. <coughs> I'm gonna make this short, but it's 5.30. Just had a shooter step out of these pines and go back in. So he's within 100 yards. Hopefully, he comes by me. Got a different setup tonight, so.
right, what's up guys? It is Wednesday the 11th. It's 3.40 right now. Um, in my drive to camp. Got about 40 minutes left of that, 45 minutes. And uh, I'll be unloading the tree stand and pack and bow out of the back. I'm actually driving my car again instead of the van. My wife's car was in the garage last week. It's a Ford, so you know how that goes. Um, but looking forward to getting out just like last week. Going to climb in, sit, some state game land, some public land, and just enjoy my time in the woods. Absolutely no expectations. Um, got the game plan together. Know where I want to be, and I just keep my fingers crossed. And I think that's about all I can hope for, so we're going to hit it. Little dough. All right, a little bit of light from camp here, but packs loaded and uh, ready to hit it. Got a little hike in here, so gonna get after it. Watch 
watching this gray squirrel climb a tree. That's about it. All right, well, I made it back to the car, ready to hit the road, drive home. Had a blast sitting up here at camp. I love this type of hunting. Um, saw those two doe and I bumped three on my way back to the car. So definitely a lot of deer in through that area. Some good buck sign as well. So I, I'm staying uh, I'm staying out of the areas that I want to hunt during the rut. Um, I have a single trail camera back in deep running that I'm not even going to check. Um, It'll just be interesting at the end of season or when I go back in and sit back there uh, end of October, beginning of November, um, just to see what's on that card. But I don't want to mess with that area. It's back in. It's really deep, really thick. Um, I don't think there's really anybody that's, that's going through there this time of year. Um, but we always, always see... Uh, scrapes and rubs uh in that area that i want to hunt so just trying to be patient and uh, and not mess myself up there um, and still come up and hunt wednesdays mornings aren't the best time to hunt this time of year um is kind of what i gather from other guys um but it's the time that I can get out up here, so I'm going to come out and give it heck every time that I have the opportunity to. So hit the subscribe button. You'll get notifications when we got something posted. Um, and uh, good luck on your hunts. If you're in Pennsylvania, you're grinding it out, shoot a big one. Stay safe and shoot straight. We'll see you next time.